So you want to make a pocket and you want to do it using the conversational tab in Pathpilot. Well, it's really easy. You just have to give it a little bit of information. Uh, here's the information you need to give it. You need to tell it what the width of the pocket is in the X value, what the width, uh, what the height of the pocket is in the, the Y value, and what radius you want on the corners. All right. You also need to tell it where to start. We're going to start at the top of the material and where to end. And we're just going to cut an eighth of an inch deep and depth of cut. We're going to do it in one pass. Uh, this is going to be a rectangular pocket. The other thing you need to know is take a look. This X from pattern table on drill tab tab and Y from pattern table on drill tab tab. There's one more thing that you have to do in order to make this pocket work. Notice that that X and Y value is the center of the pocket. So in order to make this pocket work, you have to go to the drill tab and you have to tell it what the center of that pocket is. My X value is two, so half of that is one. And my Y value is three, so half of that is 1.5. So I used X and Y, put those in the number one spot on this drill table, and then don't forget to go back to pocket and then post the file. You have to go back, back to pocket first. Don't be on drill or it'll just drill holes. So I'm going to save this as a pocket. I'm going to overwrite it because I've already saved it once. There it is. Uh, let's look at it isometrically and let's do a cycle start and see what happens. So here's my pocket. Just from that minimal information conversational, I tell it what I the, the basics and off it goes. It'll do it all for you. You can change the depth of cuts, you can change the depth of it, you can change the shape of it, all using conversational, using just those that simple little bit of information. Just don't forget to tell it where the center of that pocket is, or it won't work correctly. It won't even post. So let's suppose, too, you wanted to do a circular pocket. All you would do is you'd go back to the pocket and choose circular up here and you can make circular pockets as well. Um, it's that easy. And that's how you make a pocket using Pathpilot's conversational tab.